I'm Eddie with Hilltop Camper RV, and today we're gonna to go through a brief video on a 2022 Jayco Greyhawk 27U. I wanna point some things out on the outside, then we'll go to the inside and look at some things. First thing I wanna start off with is up front here. Jayco's got a one-piece seamless cap, where you see that there is absolutely no seams in this front cap. What's nice about that is you will never have any water issues up there because there's no seams for water to get into. You will see it's a fully fiberglass unit here. Uh, you will have flare fenders here for a little better aerodynamics. You're gonna see wider running boards so it's easier to get in and out of the motorhome here. Greyhawks will come with some other standards We'll, like, we'll have a leveling system here, which I'll show you the controls for that when we get inside. As we go down here, we're gonna see storage. You'll see your LP tanks, your water heater here, which is gonna be a gas electric water heater. It's six gallons with a quick recovery. More storage here with what they call a slam latch. So what a slam latch is, is just like it sounds. It'll slam shut and we'll lock there. Uh, we're gonna have a propane hookup here, so you could do an outdoor grill. Uh, again, more storage. Just on a Class C, Jake was gonna put storage wherever they can, so you'll see it throughout the whole coach here. When we get to the back of the coach here, you'll notice that it's got a uh, Class Three hitch that is rated for 750 pound tongue weight or 7,500 pounds towing. You've got your standard seven-way plug, as well as you got your four-way flat if you're towing a, a boat trailer or something like that. All Jayco motorhomes, I shouldn't say all, but most of them will come with a rear ladder. The ones that wouldn't is if it had a rear bedroom slide. Another big thing that Jayco does is they'll do a third brake light, which is huge about that is if you're towing something, somebody can always see that you're stopping. These LED lights back here and the third brake light are very bright. As we come around the side of the coach here, uh, we'll see that we've got LED light strip here, which is gonna be basically your exterior light, nice and bright. And as we look up there as well, you're gonna see the crown of the roof is fiberglass. All Greyhawks will come with a one piece fiberglass roof. Let's go ahead on inside. As we walk inside the 27U here, you're gonna see that there's a cab over bed which is about the size of a queen bed. A couple new things for 2022 that they've done standard is gonna be a safety net, as well as they're gonna do a rooftop solar, which we'll, we'll get to, it's down here. But the new safety net just clips up with these seat belts. And it's rated at 300 pounds for the net. The cab over bed here is rated at 750 pounds, which is an industry leader. As we look down here, we're gonna see the Ford cab that has a very large Sony camera system there, which you can adapt to your phone. It's either Apple Play or Google Play. Uh, we will have side view cameras, we'll have backup camera, and we'll have radio, Bluetooth. All those are integrated into that big Sony screen. These seats will actually pivot around and it'll have booster seats that'll sit on top of there. As we go to the dinette here, this will have seat belts at every seat. In a Jayco motorhome, wherever there's a seat, there's a seat belt. So the dinette here, we've got four seat belts. As we pan here to the uh, couch here, we've got two seat belts there. This table will drop down and make into a bed. And it's very easy to do. It just flips down and then you put the cushions on top of that. Otherwise you have a hydraulic that'll assist you in putting it back up and uh, sets back into place. The nice thing about that is you don't have any pedestals that you're kicking with your feet. So right here, we've got our kitchen where we've got some good counter space here. You will have some sink uh, toppers here so you get more counter space here. You've got an extension table that'll go off the side there. As we look in the corner here, you've got one of my favorite options. It's a, a pop-up electrical strip with USB ports in it. You've got a flush mount stove top here with a glass uh, top there that will fold up, act as a backsplash, as well as more counter space here. 
Your microwave is gonna be standard microwave, more residential size. You will also have an RV oven here that uh, is good size as well. Uh, here we've got an eight cubic foot RV style fridge. What's nice about these North Cold, North Cold fridges is it's got a lip here. So when things defrost, it's very easy to soak up the water there. But this will run off propane or electricity. Next to the refrigerator, we've got a pantry. We've got some shelves that are built in and then just another little cubby down here. As we uh, look back here, we're going to see the bedroom here. You see it's kind of cut off by different colors. We've got, you know, the modern farmhouse decor on the, in the kitchen side here. And then we've got more of your traditional wood in the back here. Jayco will use a wood pocket door to close off the rooms. So in the bedroom here, you've got a nice size wardrobe here where you've got hanging storage here. You've got drawers here. All the drawers in Jayco's are fully box frame drawers with ball bearing slides that are rated for 75 pounds a piece. So in the bathroom here, we're gonna have a foot flush stool. You're gonna have a medicine cabinet. You will have a good size shower with glass doors. Uh, you also find that there's a skylight in the shower for a little more headspace. And then what Jayco did is they added a bar inside the shower just for extra hanging space. So it acts as another closet. Uh, in a Jayco, you will always will have heat as well as air conditioning in every room. So even the bathroom has got a heat duct as well as an air conditioning duct. All right, in the back of the bedroom, we will find that there's more closet and wardrobe space. You'll find opening closet doors here where you've got shelving. And on the other side, we're gonna have a hanging bar as well as adjustable shelving there. You'll find some more drawers that are deep and uh, a couple of them there. You will see that each side of the bed has windows. We've got lights for reading. Uh, you'll see that they're two different colors. You can either do it in a white or you can do it in a soft blue if uh, you wanted to read late at night. One big difference about this that you'll see is you've got a, queen, a king size bed. Uh, that is standard on the 27U is a king size bed. This measures 70 by 76 long. All right, as we're leaving the coach here, you'll notice a couple things. Uh, you've got all Greyhawks will come with a padded ceiling. What's huge about that is one, we've got the fiberglass exterior ceiling or roof, and we've got the padded interior ceiling, which is gonna be a big deal for sound. It's gonna be very quiet going down the road and will give you a little more of an insulation factor there. You'll notice the sticker here that says two plus three. That is Jayco's warranty. They've got a two year limited warranty on all the components inside. And then you've got a three year structural, which is the industry leader. I wanted to thank you guys for taking the time to view this video. Again, today we looked at the Jayco Greyhawk 27U uh, Class C motorhome.